You may not have played with them since you were a kid, <laughs> magnets, but they are more than just a toy. Now they are big business here in Central Texas. They really are. Novion Magnetic Associated its grand opening over the summer. The San Marcos Company makes magnets for everything from medical equipment to the tiny motors that you have in your car. And they do it in a unique way. Joining us to talk, talk to us about it, Eric Hendrickson, the company is using old magnets so they can make new ones. That's right, Sally. Traditionally, magnets are made by mining rare earth metals. But doing this uses up natural resources and requires a lot of energy to collect, process, and then ship those materials. Novion Magnetics gains some of their materials this way, but they also take old magnets, break them down, then reforge them in these giant furnaces before magnetizing the metal by pumping them with magnetic energy. Co-founder Catalina Tudor says their company is the only one in the country producing magnets this way, and that's a super important thing as the demand for magnets grows. Many applications today, they use uh, neodymium iron boron magnets uh, inside of them. And we're experiencing a miniaturization of devices, and we're seeing a, a huge increase in, um, in uh, modern technologies. Now, magnets can be found in everything from the mirrors in your car to your phone. And these magnets are actually permanent. They'll keep their charge as long as they aren't put under extreme heat or duress. Later this morning on KXAN Weather and Traffic, we'll look at the role magnets will play in the battle against climate change. Now, the company can cut magnets into a variety of shapes and sizes. Some of them are about the size of my fist, a little bigger, and some of them are as tiny as pencil lead. Wow. And those are used in, like, phones and watches and little motors and stuff. I was surprised how often magnets are used in tiny little motors that we use every day. Yeah. Really? Yeah. yeah. Are the big ones just for bigger motors? MRI, uh, oh, yeah. imaging devices. Mm. They're big and chunky and they wouldn't let me pick them up. But, uh, cause you know <laughs> you I tried. wanted to pick them up. like, let me touch this. Yeah. I, you know I like to metal. touch everything I can when I go to these <laughs> yeah. places. I'm like, can I? And they're like, no, you can't touch yeah. that. And they had special gloves on and everything. That's really yeah. I think it's so. really cool that um, one of the co-founders was a woman too. Yeah. You know, women in STEM is a huge deal. So it was good to see that.